Hi everyone, how's it going? Welcome to Quick Learn and for today's video, I'll be showing you how to send email using MailChimp. Now without further ado, let's get started. First, open up your computer browser and head on to the MailChimp website right here. So as you can see, I have already created an account and if you want to create an account, just simply um, start free trial. So I'm just going to show you what that actually is. Right about here just simply click on start free trial and of course you have a bunch of plans available so if you want to pay for a plan you can actually do that but um, if you want to um, have a free trial or a free um, plan just simply select on sign up for free right here and just enter your desired email username and your password and now you are good to go so once I have already done this it will actually lead me to this page right here now I'm gonna to explain to you what this actually is so under the campaigns right here as you can see these are the campaigns that I have currently have and these are the campaigns I have actually made right about here so as you can see I have made a one email campaign right here that says coffee and if you have um, a lot of campaigns that you have actually made you can actually add or some of those campaigns will actually view here Next is the campaign manager. So as you can see right here, um, the campaign manager is actually um, a, a campaign manager which um, tracks your campaigns, the performance of your campaigns, on wh whether or not your campaign is looking good. Um, you, can act um, you can actually have a multi-channel campaign calendar, an SMS webhook, some campaign reports, and some send day optimizations. So um, next is the email templates. So as you can see right here, these are the email templates that I have actually created. And these are the email templates that I have actually um, used um, based on what I have done here so far. So as you can see right here, once I click on this, this is the email template that I have actually used. So automatically, once you create a um, an email campaign, you will choose an email template and it will be actually saved right here. Next is the automation. So as you can see, these are the overview of your store or, or your campaigns. So as you can see, you can just look into this. So I am on a free plan and I have to upgrade a plan to enjoy any of this. So next is all journeys. So as you can see, um, all journey is um you, you can deliver great experiences with this you have some automated marketing helps to reach more customers with less efforts and with more results so you have also some pre-built journeys right about here so as you can see you can click on some of this if you want to right about there and next is the transactional email so it is ideal for sending fast highly personalized one-to-one -one messages via API or SMTP. So once I click on that, as you can see right here, um, um, you can pick a plan or you can try it for free. So all you have to do is choose any of that. Next is the audience. So as you can see, you can add your contacts right here. If you have a contact in mind, so just click on add your contacts right about here. And now you can actually import from our device. You can upload a file, a CSV file or whatsoever, or you can simply copy and paste um, all of your contacts so that's about it next is the analytics so as you can see these are the analytics right here so these are some of the reports on whether or not your email campaigns are doing well so as you can see these are some of my engagements um, right about here so basically that's about it and of course your performance so this is about how many I have actually gained my revenue my orders my click-through rate right about here as an average order revenue now um. I don't want to focus on any of this because I will show you how you can actually create an email campaign and send it to a particular email address. So first, all you have to do is click on create right here. And of course, you have the option whether or not what email you want to have. So if you want to create a regular email, you just select this or you want some automation, just select this. And of course, if you want to build a landing page, you can actually select this. So for now, I'm just going to design email right here or you can actually um, um, click on the drop down right here and you have um, some options whether or not to send a regular email, a plain text email or you can actually use a template. So for now I'm just going to select a plain text right here and the campaign name let's just say um, um, order now for 50% discount 
So I'm just going to click on begin. And once I have done that, it will lead me to this one right here. So I have the option to actually um, whether or not to um, whether or not where will I actually send this one. So if I want to send this to an entire audience that I have in my contacts, I'm just going to click here or you can actually tag someone or you can just simply add this to a group. So for now, I'm just going to collect select entire audience and i'm gonna head on next right about here and it will lead me to this page right here so for now on um, the email subject you can actually say um the email subject is regarding um discounts and the preview text you can actually say order now for a big discount right about there and you can actually say from you can actually say um from john john phillips right about there and now you can now select your email address. So make sure to select the email address that you have in your um, MailChimp. So once you have done that, you can now go to the tracking options. So just click on this if you want to uh, have a track opens or click on this if a track HTML clicks. And you can actually um, track plain text right about here. And you can actually um, select this one if you want to. And now some social media. Uh, make sure to connect your Twitter or to connect your Facebook if you want this particular email to post on the social media. Then next, once you have done that, you can actually go to the next right here. And as you can see right here, these this is the example email that we can send. So just make sure to um, do this as you will or you just, um, you know, check if everything is already right so once i have done that i'm just gonna get to next right about here and all i have to do is to confirm right about here so once i have done that um, we are now good to go so that's it for the plain text so i'm i'm gonna show you the next email um campaign right right about here so head on, head on, head on to create again. And if you want to, um, you know, make an email with the template, just click on template. And of course, just select get started. And now you can actually have a, the new builder or you can actually select the classic builder. So for now, I'm just going to select the classic builder right here. And from here on, you can now actually select a theme that you want to use. So for now, I'm just going to select this layout. And right about here, you can now actually add some text, some box text, some dividers, some images, some image groups, some some image cards, and, and so on and so forth. So um, if you want to have a logo, I suggest you go to canva.com. This is a great um, platform where, where you can actually create a logo. So once you're in Canva, just select a logo template so you can actually do that. So as you can see, the, they have a lot of logo templates where you can actually use and just um, select any of the logo or you can customize your logo and you can actually do that right here by um, you can actually select the logo and putting it right here so as you can see for example um, I want to add a text right here so I'm just gonna go to box text right here as you can see right here you can actually edit this one right about here so I'm just gonna type on edit right here and let's say um, by now for example that's about it. So I can actually um, make this bold and select the size of it. So I'm just going to select um, right there. And you can actually select the font style of your choice right about there. And next, if you want to add a photo, just simply click on this and just go to um, right about there. Go to settings. Click on replace right here and now you can add a photo. So for example, I'm just going to add this photo real quick and just click on insert. So you can see you're right here. And if you want to edit this text, you can just actually um, delete this and add a text of your choice. So next is I want to save and close this one. So for example, we are now done with our email. So all you have to do is to click on save and exit. Or you can actually um, preview and test right about here. So all you have to do is to... Um, save and exit right here and maybe later so we get to name our template so for example um template one so i'm just going to save that and now we are now done with that and now all you have to do is to send this one so all you have to do is to click on this template 
of course click on share right here and now you can answer the emails that you want to actually send this to so for example I'm gonna send this to someone right here you can actually type that and just just simply share the template or you can actually share this by URL so you can just simply copy this one and just you know send this to a particular email that you want to send and once they click on that particular URL or the particular link that you actually save or send this will be what they will be showing so as you can see that's it for this video and I hope you get the idea of what I'm trying to tell you so um, if you have some comments some questions even some suggestions just feel free to comment it down under the comment section below so with that being said thank you for watching this video and i hope you find this video helpful and if you do please don't forget to give this video a like subscribe to this com channel and of course click on that notification bell to be notified for future videos bye